Meatballs is a 1979 Canadian screwball comedy film directed by Ivan Reitman in his directorial debut. Starring Bill Murray in his first ever feature film, the story follows Tripper Harrison, the head camp counselor who leads a group of new counselors in training, or CITs, at Camp North Star, a cut-rate summer camp located in Ontario, Canada. Tripper leads the CITs in managing the camp activities, playing practical jokes on the camp director, Morty Melnick, and also maintains a rivalry between Camp North Star and Camp Mohawk, a rich kids' camp on the other side of the lake. I'm Jay Haynes for the Film Trivia YouTube channel. Let's talk about meatballs. It just doesn't matter! This film was the breakthrough film role for Bill Murray. John Belushi actually convinced him to accept the role by pointing out that it would be his first film and that he would be the star. Ivan Reitman didn't even know whether Bill Murray would be in the movie until he showed up for the first day of filming. The red shorts and colorful Hawaiian shirt that Bill Murray is seen wearing in the movie were his own personal clothes. When talking to the news crew, Tripper introduces himself as Camp Mohawk Program Director Jerry Aldini. I'm the Program Director, Jerry Aldini. Jerry Aldini is the name of Bill Murray's lounge singer character on Saturday Night Live. Jack Blum, who plays Spaz, actually started off as the film's casting director. He fed the Spaz lines to potential actors. When they couldn't find an actor to play Spaz, Jack Blum got the part. The movie was filmed at an actual summer camp, Camp White Pine in Halberton, Ontario. Most of the extras in the film were actual campers and counselors of the camp, and most of all the locations were actual camp facilities. The film's main score was written by Elmer Bernstein. In addition to that, several musicians also contributed to the soundtrack, including Mary McGregor, David Naughton, and Rick Dees, who is most famous for the satirical novelty song Disco Duck. Meatballs was a surprise hit grossing $70 million on a budget of only $1.2 million. This made it the most successful Canadian movie in history at the time of its release. I'm Jay Haynes for the Film Trivia YouTube channel. Do you know any more interesting trivia tidbits about Meatballs? If so, let me know in the comments below. I would love to hear them. Also, please do me a favor and like this video. And if you haven't, subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to click the little bell icon for notifications. Videos come out twice per month. Until next time, ah, the heck with surgery. Let's wrestle.